Welcome back everyone. This video is a tribute to all the stars who created wonderful memories for us, and we honor their lasting legacy. But before we start, let me know if you recognize any of the following actors and actresses. When did you notice? Andrew Duggan, born in 1923, had an illustrious career spanning three decades with over 100 film and television roles. He excelled in dramatic and comedic roles, earning a devoted following for his ability to evoke emotions. His performance in Mosby's Marauders as John S. Mosby received critical acclaim, cementing his status as one of Hollywood's most talented actors. Duggan appeared on popular TV shows such as Perry Mason, The Rifleman, and Bonanza, and was a regular on Firehouse and Rango. He passed away in 1988 due to cancer, but his legacy lives on through his impressive body of work. Andrew Duggan remains a beloved figure among fans and colleagues alike and will be remembered as one of the greats of the golden age of cinema. Royal Dano, born in 1922, was an American actor who starred in over 200 films and TV shows. He was known for his distinctive voice and towering height of 64. Dano appeared in various genres, including dramas and comedies, with notable roles in The Life and Legend of Wyatt Earp, the outlaw Josie Wales, and The Right Stuff. He received critical acclaim for his work, earning a Primetime Emmy nomination for Redigo and a Western Heritage Award for the Great Northfield Minnesota Raid. Despite his success, Dano remained humble, once saying, I'm pretty much myself. Dano passed away in 1994 at 71 due to a heart attack, but his legacy lives on through his memorable performances. Albert Basserman, 1867-1952, was a respected German actor, renowned for his performances in classical plays on stage. His role as Shylock in a 1920 production of The Merchant of Venice was considered the definitive interpretation of the character. Basserman was known for his ability to convey complex emotions and his commanding stage presence. Sadly, he was forced to flee Germany in 1933 due to his Jewish heritage and his career was cut short. He continued acting in other countries until his health began to fail, and he passed away in Zurich in 1952 at the age of 84. Despite the challenges he faced, Basserman remains an inspiration to actors and theater enthusiasts, his legacy transcending language and culture. Oleg Vidov, a Russian-American actor, gained fame in the 1960s for his roles in popular Soviet films, later appearing in Hollywood films. His most notable achievement was his role in the 1961 film Nine Days of One Year, for which he received the Best Actor Award. Vidov's popularity was due to his good looks and charm. He passed away on May 16, 2017, at 73 due to complications from cancer. Despite his untimely death, Vidov's legacy as a talented actor and international heartthrob lives on, inspiring many actors and entertaining audiences worldwide. Fred Willard was a celebrated American actor and comedian, known for his roles in mockumentaries such as This Is Spinal Tap and Best in Show, and his work on The Tonight Show with Jay Leno and Modern Family. He was renowned for his impeccable comedic timing and was nominated for four Emmy Awards. Despite his many achievements, Willard will be best remembered for his kindness, wit, and infectious smile. He passed away on May 15, 2020, at 86, due to natural causes. Willard's legacy lives on through his many memorable performances and the countless lives he touched throughout his career. He was a legendary figure in the world of comedy and will continue to inspire future generations of actors and comedians. Rest in peace, Fred. Gilbert Rowland, a Mexican-American actor, gained fame for his dashing looks and debonair personality, making him a favorite of audiences worldwide. He appeared in over 100 films, including The Sea Hawk and The Bad and The Beautiful, and earned a Golden Globe nomination for his performances in The Brave Bulls and Cheyenne Autumn. Roland was a philanthropist who supported various charitable organizations, and he founded the Latin American Cinema Directors Guild to promote Mexican culture in Hollywood. He passed away at 88 from cancer, leaving a lasting legacy as a pioneering Latino actor who broke down barriers in the industry. 
John Arledge was a versatile American actor, best known for his role in The Social Network as Dean Fitzgerald. He starred in various productions, including Glee, Law and Order, Special Victims Unit, and Boardwalk Empire, as well as movies such as The Other Guys, Win Win, and The Dictator. Arledge's natural acting skills and dedication to his craft earned him recognition from peers and fans alike. He had a unique ability to evoke emotions and connect with audiences, making him a sought-after actor. Sadly, he passed away in 2013 due to complications from heart surgery, leaving behind a legacy that will continue to inspire future generations. Ernest Torrance, a Scottish-American actor, had a remarkable career spanning two decades from the 1910s to 1930s. He played a wide range of characters from tough villains to comedic sidekicks. One of his inspiring achievements was his role as the captain in the 1920 silent film, The Sea Beast. His performance was critically acclaimed, helping establish him as a leading actor in Hollywood. Torrance also played the father of Buster Keaton's character in the classic comedy, Steamboat Bill Jr., 1928. His commanding presence, impressive acting skills, deep, resonant voice, and distinctive scar on his cheek added to his allure. Despite his death due to a heart attack in May 1933 at age 61, 